Good morning everyone, my name is Persia as the representative of our team which consists of me, Persia Alfiasha, Mr. Eko Pujanto, and Mr. Joko Triano. I would like to thank ICMC 2021 for the opportunity so we can share the result of our research. As you can see on the screen, we are going to present about <coughs> multi-criteria optimization of 3D printing floor sector using Taguchi method and PCR toxics for dimensional accuracy and printing duration. So, as we all know, we've been struggling to fight COVID-19 and the outbreak is started on 2020. Based on the previous research by Mora in 2020, there are 15 to 20% COVID-19 patients required medical treatment in hospital, and 25% of them are needed ventilator. This phenomenon causes the high demand of ventilator which cannot be fulfilled with the existing supply. And one of the solution to fulfill this demand is by using the ventilator splitter which divides the use of ventilator from one patient to two patients at once. As the ventilator splitter is being produced using 3D printing method, we would like to find the optimal setting level with the optimal dimensional accuracy and printing duration. Um, but due to the time limit of experiment, we will focus our experiment to the floor sector only, which is one of the important part of ventilator splitter and we are using uh, Mr. Alexander Clark's design for our research. And now moving to our research objective, the first is to find the optimal factor level combination of 3D printer with PLA filament to, get, to gain the optimal dimension and printing duration of floor resistor. And the second one is to find the significant factor of 3D printed floor resistor. And these are uh, several references from the similar previous research about 3D printing optimization. Therefore, we chose these three factors, which are nozzle temperature, infill density, and layer height, to be optimized to get the smallest length deviation, inside diameter deviation, outside diameter deviation, and printing duration. And this table on the screen shows the level of each factor. The level of nozzle temperature is chosen based on the PLA filament characteristic as for infill density and layer height are chosen based on the previous literature review. And in our research, we applied the Taguchi method to solve the problem. As we have three factors with uh, each three levels, so we use the L9 orthogonal array matrix as shown on this table. And let us move to the floor resector design from Alexander Clark, as you can see on the screen. This design is already met the ISO standard for the respirational equipment, and to be specific, this floor resistor is the 22mm type of floor resistor, and using the PLA filament and 3D printer, uh, 3D printer machine. And so, the experiment was taking place in a product design and planning laboratorium of industrial engineering department in Splash Smart University. The type of 3D printer machine that we use is uh, Prusa i4, and the filament is PLA Polylite. And there are 9 combinations according to the orthogonal array matrix, we, uh, with each combination printed uh, with 3 replications. So in total, we do the 27 specimens printed. And next, after we printed all specimens, we are doing the measurement process using the vernier caliper and screw micrometer and transform the measurement result into the percentage of deviation using the three mathematical equation. The first is length deviation, and uh, the second one is inside diameter deviation, and the third one is outside diameter deviation. And the table shown on the screen is showing uh, the measurement result for each specimen. For the length, inside and outside diameter are in deviation percentage using the previous mathematical equation, while the printing du uh, duration is in second. And the previous obtained data then being analyzed using the smaller the better type of SNR. And for the length deviation, inside diameter and outside diameter deviation, the biggest SNR value is in the sixth experiment while for uh, the printing duration is in the seventh experiment and therefore the future analysis is needed using the additional method which is PCR topsis and this PCR topsis method is a multi criteria optimization which can provide the optimum setting level combination for more than one response 
and the optimum combination in our research is in the six experiment because it has the highest PCR toxic value as you can see on the table it is 0 0.612 and the next one is the analysis of variance to find the most significant factor in our research as you can see on the screen the most significant factor is layer height because its p-value is 0 0.044 which means it is below the 0 0.05 and finally the confirmation test is needed to confirm the factor level combination and this confirmation test is done with three replication with uh, 225 degree celsius of nozzle temperature 75 percent of infill density and 0 0.1 millimeters of uh, layer height and this result is, show, is shown on this table and afterward we calculate the confidence interval using this mathematical equation the first one is optimal setting which is for the sixth experiment and the confirmation test is for the specimen that we just printed in confirmation test and these are the result of the confidence interval for optimum, optimal setting level, which is the sixth experiment, and the confirmation test. It can, uh, it can be seen that the confidence interval between optimal and con confirmation conditions are in the same interval. Hence, it can be concluded that the confirmation test is, is uh, accepted. And since the confirmation test is uh, accepted, this is the final setting level to obtain the, op uh, the optimal slow resistor. The 225 degrees Celsius for nozzle temperature, 75% infill density, and 0.1 mm layer height. In conclusion, we've got from the Taguchi and PCR process method, to obtain the optimal flow restrictor with length deviation, inside and outside diameter deviation, and printing temperature simultaneously is at the combination of 225 degrees Celsius of nozzle temperature, 75% infill density, and 0.1 mm layer height. And the result of the specimen printed with this combination have met the ISO standards and the order of factors that have the greatest influence of 3D printed 22mm floor resistor is layer height and then followed by nozzle temperature and followed by uh, the infill density. Um, and uh, future research with bigger level gap and various parameter of 3D printing machine is needed for more evident result prints. And we also realize there are some flaws in our research as well. So we would be very welcome for any suggestion, suggestions to improve our research. And that brings up, uh, and that brings us to the end. I sincerely appreciate your attention today, and thank you for your time.